Hey guys, this is Fishy. Have you ever thought about why are there parallel blocks of concrete below the rail track and why are there a type of stones in the rail tracks? I'm going to be telling you the answer to this question in this video. The concrete on which the tracks rest is known as sleepers. These sleepers help reduce the pressure. You may know that pressure is directly proportional to force and inversely proportional to the area. So for the same force which is the weight of the train, if the area is more the pressure is less and if the area is less the pressure is more. If the rail tracks were to be laid directly on top of the ground, the area is very less. But when sleepers are present, the area is much more in comparison to the first situation. So the sleepers increase the area and hence decrease the pressure. So when such a heavy load of the train passes on top of the track, it prevents the track from not sinking into the ground. The stones found in the track are known as ballast. The ballast has many purposes. The first purpose is to keep the rail and the sleeper in place. It also keeps the track at a higher ground so that the track does not get flooded. It prevents vegetation from growing near the track and it also helps in better seepage of the water. But why are only sharp edged stones found in the track? This is because if a smooth edge stone was present in the track, it would roll over when a train with such a heavy load passed over it and the smooth edges would not interlock with each other which is the case with the sharp edge stones. If you like the video, do subscribe Mixapian. This is Fishy signing off.